All right, everybody, what is up? It's Thunder. Welcome back. We finally made it here, fellas. We made it to Hard Hat. Oh, my goodness, the amount of walking I had to do just to get into this lobby. Those of you following me on Twitter know all about it already. If you're not following me on Twitter, link down below in the description. Uh, yeah, we're doing a whole lot of walking, fellas. And when you look around in society today and you look at these gas prices, man, yo, walking might not be such a bad idea. <laughs> Damn, son. Yo, <laughs> tell you what, man, uh, just when the pandemic is over or almost over and people start to like go outside and actually go places, then you go ahead and look at these gas prices. You're like, yeah, we're going back in the house. Yeah, it's like so there's someone out there, some force trying to keep us in the house, fellas. Nobody wants us to go outside. It ain't Call of Duty. If anything, Call of Duty trying to get us to go outside. <laughs> but you look at the pandemic and then you go ahead and look at these crazy gas prices that are starting to pop off. Uh, yeah, it's it's tough out there, man. It really is. Uh, everything's going up. Everything's going up, man. <laughs> the skill-based matchmaking going up. Price of gas going up. Price of groceries. Everything. Woo, damn, son. Do, do we have another Manscaped ad here? I'm going to have to get some. <laughs> yeah, look at this dude. This dude could use some Manscaped right here. He looking rough, man. Woo. He could definitely use some of that ball spray right about now. <laughs> Yeah, but oh my goodness damn he's still yo he's still doing an odell right through the door man oh my goodness <laughs> anyway uh damn get bodied son yo people want to know why i keep playing this game i i told you guys man modern warfare 2022 pretty much gonna be a carbon copy of this game actually you shouldn't even call it modern warfare more like madden warfare oh my goodness he bunny hopped right into that claymore didn't he he, he bunny hopped right up into that claymore <laughs> Yo, this is too funny, man. This is why I play this game, man. Trolling these nerds with the claymores and the shotgun. Uh, just too irresistible. There's no other way to play it, really. Uh, unfortunately. Uh, but, yo, I want to talk about something real quick, fellas and COD. Uh, remember when we used to have a thing called specialist abilities? I'm not talking about MW3 specialists, which was great. I'm talking about Black Ops 3, Black Ops 4 specialists, where you had the little extra abilities to go along with your perks. Uh, does anybody actually miss those? I kind of do. I, I kind of do miss the specialist. I miss the cheese. Uh, I don't know. The cheese just made the game fun. It just sweating and sliding all over the place and bunny hopping. It it's not fun for me. It feels like work. The, sp the specialist made you play casually and cheese people. And it was just fun. Like, I ain't that dude who's going to come out here and slide and bunny hop and do all these crazy, like break my thumb, bend my thumbs backwards to get a kill. Uh, that ain't me anymore, man. I'm never going to be that guy again. I'm all set. <laughs> the days of me bunny hopping five times in a kill cam or slide canceling all over the place, that, that just ain't me, dude. I can't do it. Not at this stage of the game. Uh, I miss the cheese factor. I think the OGs prefer the cheese, man. I don't, I don't know too many OG COD players who are still doing triple bunny hops and kill cams and, uh, you know, slide canceling all over the map. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Them days are long gone. Uh, we don't have specialist abilities anymore, but what we do have is these lame field upgrades, man, which are kind of like watered down specialist abilities. Um, probably in modern Dorfair 2022, they'll probably bring field upgrades back. Uh, could you make them a little more useful, though? I mean, the field upgrades are so trash. I don't know how I didn't kill that guy. Uh, look at the dude with the heartbeat sentiment. Yo, Warzone has ruined multiplayer in more ways than one, bro. More ways than one. Everyone out here using heartbeat sensors because they used to play in Warzone. Then again, most of the people that are here are probably just leveling up their weapons for Warzone anyway. Multiplayer ain't nothing but a conduit to Warzone. Uh, but yeah, the field upgrades suck. I mean, the ammo box is pretty trash. Uh, the only thing that's really good in here for a field upgrade is Ninja. Every other field upgrade is absolute garbage. Uh, there's really no point even running anything in here. And even in Vanguard, the field upgrades are terrible. Uh, the vest would be pretty cool in this game, uh, but the vest is pretty trash in Vanguard, isn't it? Anyone even use the vest in Vanguard? I think everyone pretty much uses either Ninja or the Dead Drop. The Dead Drop would be awesome in this game. I wish Dead Drop was in uh, Modern Warfare 2019. That would be pretty cool because you could die and still keep your streak. Uh, but I don't know. What do you guys like better? Do you guys like the special stabilities or the field upgrades? Because... Damn, I got hit with the RPG of justice. Thunder meets RPG. Ooh, I like the camo he got on that. I got to stop putting some camo on my RPG. I don't think I've even bothered putting camo on it yet. Uh, but anyway, what do you guys think? Would you guys rather see juiced up 
field upgrades, like field upgrades that are a little more useful? Or would you rather see some sort of specialist ability come back in uh, modern warfare? Imagine that, a specialist ability in a modern warfare game. Look, look at all the bunny hopping. Look at this nerd, bro. Look at that. Of course, he's got the tracer rounds and some funky camo, bunny hopping all over the place. I can't play like that anymore, dude. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm surprised I didn't profile block that, dude. Usually somebody hops more than twice in a kill cam, I immediately profile block him. Not just block him in the game. I go straight to his profile and profile block him. That seems to work. I know like Blame Truth. Blame Truth would have blocked that guy immediately. But um, I, I go right for the profile block, man. I go right for the jugular. I don't think blocking players in game actually does anything. But I think the profile block uh, will kind of keep you from getting matched up with them again. Uh, I don't know. I mean, I profile block a lot of people, and when I get in the lobby, it still says you're in a lobby. Look at this dude, still bunny hopping all over the place. Uh, I don't get it. He's got to have it programmed into his mod that just he just jumps like crazy whenever he sees anybody. It's so obnoxious. <laughs> but uh, Anyway, man, getting back to the field upgrade stuff. I think that Modern Warfare 2022 has to do something, man. You can't just be Madden Warfare. You know what I'm saying? You can't have the same game all the time. As I stun myself. Damn, fellas. Damn. It's tough to get old, boys. <laughs> Still got to kill the... <laughs> I saw out here flash... Yo, I, my eyesight is bad enough, man. I don't need to be flashbanging myself on top of it. Uh, but Modern Warfare needs to do something to make the game fun, man. Please, just make the game fun. That's all I want. Uh, I, I would like to play the game in different ways to have fun. I shouldn't have to just be sitting here with a shotgun and claymores trolling these nerds. Uh, just to have a good time in this game. Uh, the one good thing about Modern Warfare 2 was uh, it was just crazy. Everything was overpowered. Everything was fun. I kind of miss that. I don't know. Th these these modern games that are coming out now, super boring, right? Cold War, one of the most boring games I've ever played since COD Ghosts. Look at this dude, buddy. I've <laughs> been getting bodied, son. Uh, Vanguard's just an absolute disaster. And this game right here, I mean, oh my goodness, man. Uh, yo. <laughs> for this game the amount of time limit gameplays i played in this game insane bro absolutely insane and we're gonna call in the harrier and i'm right about to get my wop <laughs> my white ass phosphorus but watch what happens to me right here man look at this so i'm just chilling i'm like trying to trying to listen for footsteps that's all this game is just dude sitting around listening for footsteps right so i'm trying to listen now this dude throws this dude was pretty good with the flashbangs he got me he got me. He got me with the flashbang grenade. Got me all messed up. Got me all shook. Oh, my goodness. Then he just had, like, super lag on his side right there. He was bunny hopping through the door and killed me uh, before I could even get my shot off. <laughs> he had the lag advantage from bunny hopping around the corner. <laughs> nice play. Nice play by that dude, man. Throwing the flashbang, spamming rockets, bunny hopping with the shoddy. He definitely came correct. <laughs> but anyway, guys. Listen, Modern Warfare 2022, man, we're going to be playing this game for two years. It can't be exactly like this, which is what I'm hearing. I'm hearing Modern Warfare 22 is exactly like Modern Warfare 19, except just more of it. Uh, I don't know. They need to spice it up, bro. Bring back pro perks. Jazz up the, the field upgrades. I mean, the field upgrades in this game were trash. You had, like, Ninja. That was good. Pretty much everything else was garbage. <laughs> the, the ammo box would blow you up for crying out loud. Uh... I don't know. They need to do something. Bring back pro perks. Maybe mix in some special stability. Do something, damn it. We're going to be playing this game for two years. It better be fun, man. <laughs> you can't just be releasing Madden Warfare every year. Anyway, fellas, what do you guys think, man? Drop it down in the comment section. Uh, two years of Modern Warfare 2022. It better not be exactly like this. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> Even though I did play this game for two years in a row, I really don't want to play it for four. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Anyway, guys, thank you all so much for watching. And I'll see you on the next one.